Hello, you beautiful viewers. I'm Sonny Edwards. This is Yorson Homes. This is Shell House in Palomarta, and I'm about to show you around the inside. My inbox has been absolutely spammed on this one. We put it on about a month ago, just provisionally, showing you what the outside's like. We now have the keys to get inside, so you can all stop emailing me and asking what it looks like inside. I'm gonna show you right now. Just a quick recap, in case you missed the first video. Beautiful, lovely house, wonderful location, right in the heart of the best village in this region, Barndun, Palomarta. Check that roof out, it's brand spanking. And I don't just mean it's had new tiles, the whole, the whole thing, the whole shebang is brand new. All of that, all of the joists, it's all new wood under there. All of the felt, it's been fully felted, it's been properly done very, very nicely. Not just that, the rendering, it's all brand spanking all the way around. The triple glazed UPVC, yes I said triple, not just double, posh here, mahogany effect. Wow, 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 look at this place. And it's ready for you to put your stamp on. Wait till you see the inside, it's just ready for you to come and do as you please here. So here it is, I'm gonna try and not talk too much through this one. Let's just show you, because you don't need to hear me going on. You can see for yourselves how beautiful this house is. Beautiful. Yep, tick. Like it if you think it's beautiful. Yep. Okay, so up into here. Let's I tell you what, we've got, it's a little bit of a, let's start over here. Because here you have an entirely separate room. So this could, in theory, become an annex. You've got enough space in here to do a bedroom and an ensuite. Just giving you ideas, you can do whatever you like here. But look, oh, it's beautiful and cool in here. Very, very nice space, very good. Coming straight out into here, you can have your own little decking and your own little your own little space. Excuse the garden, it is overgrown. It's the middle of the summer. We've been rain, sun, rain, sun, and that's how it goes sometimes. But check this room out. Imagine it being your choice, an annex, or watch that wall there, because we're coming back through into that side in a minute. So outside, look, just let me be quiet so you can just hear. Nice, just the sound of bird song. So again, in through the front, here we go. Good, what a nice big space. So this, from, it can be what you want. Don't listen to me. But if it was me, this would become a kitchen. You then have the option here. That separate room was in there. That could become a private annex for if you want guests or family to stay or if you wanted to make it a little, into a little guest house, very possible. Or you could bang a door in there or even a nice big arch going all the way around. This very vast room here, and it is big, could become your kitchen and then your dining room in there. Just an idea. You can do what you want, but you know, just throwing ideas out there. Now, what I like they, they hear that they've done, it's very, very good, is they've kept it so that it's, yes, it's all brand, brand new. It's all brand spanking, but, this, when it's rendered up and you leave that bit of wood showing and that rendered naturally, this, it, it's very, very much in keeping. It's, it, it's suited to the house. It's, it's brand new, but old style. And that, personally, that's the way I like it. Um, you could render it all over and make it look brand new and all smooth and crisp and clean, but that would just be boring and it wouldn't really suit the character of the house. I like what they've done here because look, they have it prepared, ready for some very, very nice rendering, showing the exposed wood and just looking absolutely fantastic. Another room in here, they've done the same thing here. Okay, that one needs to be rendered properly. These ones, they, they put these breeze blocks in here and the way they've done it is ready to really render it up and make it look very, very traditional, like a traditional home. So it will look old school, but brand new. And that is really the way to do it. Now look, a big, big space up here. I'm not gonna talk, start talking about ideas. Make your own up. But look, one room here, and again, all done, ready for very, very easy render with the exposed wood. The brick when rendered up, it will look Beautiful, it will. It will look fantastic in here. Another very, very good sized room. Views, private, but nice views. Again, that's the little driveway in. Nice, good, yep. And another room there. So you've kind of got three rooms and a big landing space. Then the other big landing space, which could become a lounge, leading onto the kitchen, leading onto whatever you want. And 
don't forget that little room in there. Now come out here, because look, this. I mean, just wow, beautiful, lovely. Yes, very, very nice. Imagine this being your top deck. A few little chairs and a bit of tables out here. Let me shut up for a minute and you just listen to that. That's what we call peace and quiet. And, and look at this beautiful balcony. Nice, 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 all brand spanking. Very, very nice. And I like they've left a few original touches in there. Look at that. Why shouldn't that be in there? Of course it should be. Yep, lovely, beautiful, very nice. And again, the whole the whole of the house has been rendered. I will take some photos of the whole house all the way around so you can see just how well this house has been done. And look, on to the end. If you make some little steppy steps there and they'll bring you out so you've got separate access. That's very, very nice as well. So yeah, good. We have some new floors here. Uh, we've got loads of new stuff here, actually. It goes, it's, yeah, wow, just, it's good. It's great. Let's show you downstairs quickly. So those are the top levels. Yes, levels. One, two. We're going to call this a three-level house because, come down here. You haven't seen it all yet. You're thinking, wow, 35 grand, where do I pay? Hang on, wait, 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 wait. Look. Oh, buggery, it's locked. And again, Bug down here on the lower level, UPVC all the way throughout. You can see it's brand spanking. They haven't even took the stickers off yet. Uh, UPVC doors, windows, and let's go in and have a quick look under here. Oh, wow, incredibly cool under here. Uh, so yeah, a very nice, big, spacious room here, huge. And it goes through here. This, you know, we're not done yet. It goes on and on. Here's another room. Lovely, just really nice. So you've got that out of your little, so this could become a little bedroom or a little, whatever you want, however you'd like to do it. Um, wow, tons of space, tons of options. I mean, the, 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 the options are endless here. Don't listen to my ideas because they're probably rubbish. You'll think of something better yourself, I'm sure. But this is the one, if you want it to look exactly how you want it, your design, your layout, your own personal stamp. This is the one. I mean, no one would not like the outside. It's beautiful, it's stunning. It's, there's an absolutely, yeah, you couldn't do it any better. Let's just show you the outside again. Look, what a beautiful spot. So with this position in the village, what have you got going for you? Well, you're a three minute walk to the shops and bars but you're sunken kind of right down here in a little secret little gully. It's all yours, private little sanctuary. And it's whopping actually this house. So you've got level one, level two, well no, level one downstairs, level two, level three, huge house, huge potential, beautiful, stunning house. And at only 35 grand, you, you wouldn't buy half of that roof in England for that, would you? Come on now, it's a bargain. Get your money out. Pay a deposit, come and buy this beauty.